Hello everyone, welcome to a brand new video of the Send Rework Update. It's coming in um, two patches, however, let's take a look at it since it's already available on the PBE. Let's take a look, ladies and gentlemen. See how it is. Yes, sir. And I'll be using the new skin, which is the Heaven Scale Prestige Lee Sin. Let's see how that skin is. There we have it. Uh, divine, sorry. <laughs> it's a uh, mythic skin. Not ultimate, but mythic. Divine Heaven Skill Lee Sin. Man, there's actually a lot of Lee Sin skins over the years. Every time they uh, update a Lee Sin skin, uh, I mean Lee Sin, they have to update all the skins, which is a lot of work. Ah, that is why they retire some skins. Okay, I understand now. They retire the skins because they don't want to do all the updates to the uh, skins. I don't know why the queue times are so long, but there's always international griefers playing from like thousand ping, uh, thousand ping uh, China or something. Where is everybody? The griefers. Or I can just play intro with actual bots. Yeah, if it hits the two minute mark, I will. It's literally the same thing. It's literally bots with bad ping or real humans with bad ping. Like, what is the difference? There's not much difference. They're both that kind of grief. See how they can't even accept the queue? They're already griefing. Not surprised. Just annoying. Not surprised at all. Divine Lee Sin, Heaven Skill Lee Sin, let's get it. Okay, Conquer. I like Bloodline though. Hmm. But he takes attack speed. Okay, attack speed could be fine as well. Yeah, the boots and the cooldowns cause me insight. Mm. Okay, I'll just go uh, what's recommended. It is what it is. So, Divine Heaven Skill Lisa, let's get it. If you bad, I feed. <laughs> Sounds like a support main. Retarded support mains. Who's not that good to begin with. <laughs> You'll feel, feed regardless. Yeah, it's, a, it's a, definitely a support mate. Probably a girl. Yeah, the loading times are actually not bad. Some of these guys might be in NA. Not bad, fam. Not bad.
I thought it was gonna load and then we get stuck on 88 and 98 percent. Okay, there you go. Not too shabby, I guess. Not too shabby. So obviously I'm not gonna go to the sweeper because it's leasing. Uh, it is a rework of all the abilities. Uh, basically more rework on the um, abilities on uh, enemy champions. Yep. And uh, yeah, that's why I'm waking the video. Flashed. Yeah, you'll be famous. Oh, shit. Okay. Yeah, we takes these. <laughs> we takes these. I hit those. Easy. Easy dubskies. Uh, so basically, Leeson, uh, there was outcry in the uh, community about how everybody thinks uh, Lee Sin abilities, you can't really tell whether you hit the Q or you hit the W. Different abilities now give off uh, different animations. How, however, like to the average person, it doesn't really matter. That's why there's no incentive to do this. Like new skins get revenue, like these uh, type of uh, uh, APU, GPU updates, yeah, it's unnecessary. It uh, generates no revenue. And when it doesn't generate revenue, a ride's not incentivized to do this. But they did to uh, make the lease and mains happy, I guess. Sir, my Lisa is still clean. We take these. But I just don't like playing Lee Sin because he still falls off like heavily. It's not a good jungler. He's not a hyper carry, he's like a team support carry. He's good in the beginning, like he can snowball the game, however, he cannot solo carry a hard game. It's not a champion that can hyper carry, unfortunately. I mean, he can hyper carry, but like, with a huge lead, though. Just like Fiddlesticks, basically. You're trying out the Blood Moon Fiddlesticks, I see. Yeah, it's not bad. What? Oh, okay, some of the chickens were killed. Yeah, it's not bad. The only uh, issue with the Blood Moon skins. Is that it's too dark? Yeah, it's too dark. That's why I always use the light chroma. But that is a dark chroma. That's the issue with most skins, is you can't see the abilities. Because it's so dark. Like, what good is it? If it has crazy animation on a dark map, like, what good is that? Like then an animation um, is not so uh, valid when it's on a... Uh, because the map is already dark as it is. It's like a greenish brown map. And then if you do like dark animations like black, yeah, no one's going to see that. Unless you're colorblind. Maybe colorblind people can see it. You never know. But I highly doubt it. Okay, I, I thought I thought that was your word, but it's not. It's actually Lilia. Yeah. What the hell? That actually killed her? I have a single sword. That is weird. That actually killed her. Interesting. Interesting. Leeson definitely still seems very OP. 
But like I said, Leeson still falls off. That's why it's never uh, played in the lower elos, only in high elos. Like in high elos, it's awesome, but in low elos, no, it feels bad. We will finally back. Hmm. Yeah, Eclipse still seems OP because of the shield. However, hmm. I like Lethality better. Lethality! Yeah, fuck it. Let's go Lethality. And, uh, yeah, we'll get Axiom Mark. Yes, sir! Lethality Lee Sin is the best Lee Sin. Yeah, you got 25 stacks already. Uh, so basically, the intermediate bots, um, they are still planning on improving them. However, just like the Lee Sin update, there's no uh, urgency to do so. They only did this because to uh, keep the uh, keep the new player's experience alive. However, there's no incentives to do this. It only costs Riot manpower and money, and it brings nothing back, unlike a skin does. Skin generates revenue right away. So some things that they do, they only do to keep the uh, player base happy. Which is part of the experience. However, as people know, Riot does not really um, care much about the... Uh, much about the things that don't earn them money. Yeah, It's a waste of time. But, come on, money makes the world to go around. So, you can't really compare, uh, complain about that. Hmm, I'm confused about the how the W activate. Yeah, I haven't played Lisa in a long time. But the, so the W activate doesn't even require you to click anything. You just click it on yourself. Yeah, that's kind of weird. I thought you always had to go to Ally or something, or awards or something but you can just activate it on yourself that's interesting hmm. didn't know that but hey now i do easy dubskies i need all the uh the stacks Get all the champions. Yeah, Leeson W is kind of interesting. You can activate it without hitting anything. But yeah, the rework abilities, it does seem cleaner. There's much more animation than before. Like, much more. And it does seem very clean. Maybe it's this skin as well, like, this skin's a $200 skin, like, let's be honest here. Of course, a lot of work gone on to this skin. Like, everything seems pretty clean. Yeah, look, look at these abilities, yeah, it's too clean. When other champions, you can't even notice your skin. Like, especially the new skins, like, Blood Moon, especially the line of Blood Moon, yeah. I don't know. Just like there's a lot of Blood Moon skins and people just forget about it. I'll be uploading this uh, video on YouTube uh, later, so definitely you're famous now. I don't know why um, these guys are so intense on finishing the game, but 
Yeah, I don't I don't know what it is about like people like trying to uh, snowball and rush in the AI games. I like getting a full build and experimenting. Anyone can win a snowball game, no one can easily win a comeback game. That's the problem with League. Most people can't even come back in a draft game. But if you play ranked, uh, yeah, you'll soon find out that coming back from a game it requires a lot of knowledge. It's not just like snowballing leads, which is the easiest way to play the game. Anyone can snowball lead. Coming back, yeah, it's the most important league skill. And me and my friends, that uh, we have perfected it. Basically, you buy call, um, you just scale up, farm the super minions, yeah. There's various ways you can do so. And what is up with the uh, pinging in the eye? No pinging in the eye. <laughs> Yeah, those are my rules. I don't ping in the AI. Waste of time. Happy man. <laughs> man. <laughs> Who names themselves happy man? This is like so funny, man. I, I hope it's a meme. I hope it's a meme. I hope. Like, I hope. Is it be serious? Like, I don't know, bro. Like, be a little bit imaginative. Okay, I guess I should use the alt ones. I'm still trying to farm on my items. Jungle sucks. As usual. How did I miss the grubs? It's weird. Okay, there you go. Okay, so the animations seem pretty clean. Let me go use the ult and see how it feels. We'll go full of Thalny. Some healing items could be good as well. But yeah, let's get Shoujin. Actually, hmm. Yeah, there's many path. I can go. Mm, eclipse, okay, 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 eclipse. Lol. GG's. Uh, another 50 minute snowball game. Uh. Happy, happy, happy. <laughs> and there you have it. That is the Lee Sin rework. And is coming in two patches. In patch 14.9. There you go. Since you're in my stream, I will give you the honor. Enjoy. Yeah, I'm almost at the uh, 1k, uh, 1k followers. But maybe sooner or later, I'll become affiliate. But we'll see. But uh, it comes with ads. Uh, so anyways, yeah, there you have it, uh, Lee Sin, there's a lot of skins um, uh, based upon the champion, however, not all skins are made the same, as you can see here. Uh, the Zenith one is uh, kind of forgotten, but Nightbringer is always good, I have this on my uh, main account, uh, and Storm, uh, Storm Dragon Lee Sin, I have that on the main account as well, and I think I have the FPX, 
or I have the Playmaker Lee Sin skin. So we'll see how the um, we'll see how the rework comes um, online um, in the main. But yeah, I, I don't think the rework has been finished yet. But yeah, this is the uh, two hundred dollar skin, which was in the Battle Pass, I believe. Yeah. But okay, if you enjoyed this video, definitely click the like button. I'll leave a comment below for the YouTube algorithm. Hit the subscribe button and hit the ring bell notifications for more videos this in, like this in the future. But definitely hit the like button. And uh, yeah, my YouTube link is on the bottom of uh, Twitch. So yeah, check that out for those who are in the stream. See you next time. Bye-bye.